decided to come over to the Winter Todd boss and just managed to hit a 66 fire making. So here are just a few screenshots of me getting to 80 fire making from Winter Todd. Unfortunately, we didn't really get much loot. We managed to get one of the um, one of the torches and one set of gloves. But other than that, we didn't really get a lot. So yeah, I'm gonna go do some quests and see you guys then. And there is the Slug Menace quest complete. We can now wield proselyte armor. I believe if we still talk to this guy, stalk him. I believe if we talk to him, go kind of buy some armor, we should be able to buy a proselyte. Yes, we can. Awesome. And there is another quest done. Soul's Bane. That was quite an easy quest. Remember the first time I did that quest, it scared the life out of me. <laughs> but yeah, that's that quest done. On to the next one. And there is Morning Ends Part 1, quest complete with 25k hit point and Thieving XP for the end of it. And I believe we do get a level in both of those, yes we do, which is pretty amazing. So, no, <clears throat> didn't get a combat level unfortunately, but what I'm going to do, I'm going to go complete Part 2 and then hopefully be able to do some more questing. And there we go, there is Morning End, Morning's End Part 2. Two, we now have access to the death water so we can make double death runes once we get the crafting level and also 20k agility experience i don't think that actually leveled me up <clears throat> no it did not but yeah we can now access the death water which is pretty amazing but for now i'm going to go do probably two or three more quests i definitely want to do swan song in this video and yeah maybe do what lies below and making history as well so i'm gonna go do those two quests very quickly and i'll be back with you once they're done and that was quite a simple quest collecting items that wasn't too difficult but yeah there is making history done next quest i'm going to do is swan song and then what lies below then i think that'll be enough questing for the video and i'll probably do some slayer and another quest complete what lies below quite an easy one and that almost leveled up my ruin crafting unfortunately did not it came close but not quite close enough but yeah one more quest for the video and then we'll be going to do a bit of slayer oh come on no pet <laughs> dang it and there we go we have completed swan song so now we can access the uh, fishing connolly we managed to get 15k magic experience 10k prayer 10k <coughs> and 10k fishing and a little bit of coins and I think, yes, we did level up to 73 magic, which is really nice. Um, unfortunately, no fishing levels or um, prayer levels, but we are pretty close to a prayer level. Um, ooh, that'd be nice. But yeah, that is that was a really fun quest, and I do apologize for my little interruption part, but <laughs> part way through the quest. So yeah, I can now start cook fishing for monkfish, and oh, apparently you could buy them from the shop did not know that but yeah i think what i'm gonna do, go do now edit this video and then catch some monkfish so we can cook them for later on i believe i have the right cooking level for monkfish not 100 percent sure yes i do level 62 10 levels above which is great but yeah i'm going to do that for a little bit and hopefully see you with some slayer awesome caught my first two monkfish so yeah i'm going to be doing this for a little bit so i can edit this video and have some time to rest and stuff but there but yeah what i'm going to be doing after that is doing a bit of slayer and then probably end off the video because i don't want this video to be too long i know it's only rocking about two to three minutes at the moment so yeah i'm going to continue to do some fishing and jump into the slayer for a bit I'm obviously going to get my fishing and cooking level up with these. Well, I wasn't expecting this, but we just managed to get 64 fishing and a total level of 1475, which is, and we are almost at 15 mil total XP, so that's pretty awesome. But yeah, I am going to do a bit more fishing. I'm going to, probably going to fill this, the rest of this inventory up, cook them, and then hopefully go do some slayer. Got a nice and easy troll slayer task from Neve. I'm going to quickly go do that and hopefully grab some nice rewards. All right, just going to check out my miscellaneous before we go do our troll slayer task. Uh, I've just got my approval rating up to 100, so we should get some good rewards. I'm not too sure. That's actually not too bad. Uh, one rain or seed. Load of teak logs, which is really good. Okay, cool. So what I'm going to do is I know I switched this. I want to take that off of there. Put that on. I really want to get more seeds. So... I know farming. Okay, there we go. I've decided to put 100% on herbs and 50% on hardwoods. Mainly because I don't really need the. Okay, mainly because I don't really need the um, uh, maple log maple logs because I've got way too many and I'm not. I don't plan to use them for 
uh, runs anytime soon. So I'm going to put another 400k into the coffer. There we go. Back down to 1.6 mil. And there we go. So 500k in there. I will obviously, once I get more money, I will put a lot more in there. But while I'm running the 1 mil, <laughs> while I'm not at maximum cash stack just yet, I will put more in there slowly. All right. I know it's not an impressive level, but once we check this willow tree, we will get a farming level. There we go. Level 45 farming. We can now grow maples. Might actually get that done pretty soon because I really want to get my farming up as quick as possible i know i'm only level 45 i really want to get this to at least like level 70 so i can start growing the higher tier trees and stuff but yeah there is a farm level of 70 i'm going to quickly place down another willow i didn't know i was that close to them i didn't know i could farm maples so yeah i think what i'm going to go do is get some maple saplings and make them and there's my troll slayer task done as you can see i had to reset my streaks because i had a task i really didn't want to do but i had not i didn't have enough points so i reset my streak we're at four tasks at the moment, so hopefully my 10th task will be quite nice. So I'm going to head back to Neve, get another task, and see you there. Decided to switch it up. I'm going to go for Chandel uh, yeah, the Xanaris Slayer Master for now. Um, until I get to my 10th task, then I'm going to go back to Neve just for the uh, extra point bonus. But we're going to see what we can get. Ooh, Fire Giants. We can get quite a few Rune Scimitars from these guys. So let's go do that task, and I'll see you guys once it's done. Oh, it took long enough. My task is like... I've done like 100 kills and I managed to get a Rune Scimitar drop, which is really nice. Okay then, wasn't expecting that, but we got ourselves a Fire Battle Staff in nice little Alka Ball. My Alka that when I get back to the bank. But yep, yeah, still no Scimitars, I'm still on the same trip and as you can see we've still got 43 left to go. But yeah, this task is taking a while and I do need to bank because I am running out of food. Could use my prayer Pots though, so I'm not too sure. 23 Fire Giants left. And we get a second Rune Scimitar. What is the luck? It's just going to get out. But that's really lucky. Two in one trip. Two in one task. Unfortunately, we didn't get another one there. That would be quite amazing. But yeah, 22 Hill Giants. Uh, I keep going to call them Hill Giants. 22 Fire Giants left. And hopefully, we can get another one before the task is up. All right, there we go. Managed to finish our Slayer task. Quickly popped to the bank to deposit War of Horizons. Didn't really get anything else. I got another. Oh no! You saw what you saw me get the second rune scimitar. So never mind about that. But we are going to get another assignment. As you can see, we actually got uh, our fifth task from Neve. Oh, Dagonoth. So, ooh, I want to do Dagonoth at the same time. I, ooh, do you know what? I'm going to do it. I'm going to do it. But first, I'm going to do a quick farm run, and then we're going to hopefully get a farm level. I'm pretty close to level 46, so that would be pretty awesome. But yeah. I'm going to quickly go do this farm run, and then we'll be back with the rest of that Slayer task. All right, I believe this is a farming level. Yep, should be able to get one from this. There we go. 46 farming. We can now do. We can now get triple willow roots. I'm not 100% sure what the roots are for, but I don't. right now I don't plan to collect them. Um, I don't actually have any maple seeds at the moment, so unfortunately we cannot do that. Come on. Do it the quicker way. Here we go. Sorry. I don't know why I did that because I don't have any seeds to plant. But yeah, there is another farming level. Unfortunately, it's quite a low one. So I'm going to try and try and go get some more seeds from Winter Todd. And hopefully, we can start our farming again. Tree farming again. But yeah, I've just got one more farm patch to do. And then we're going to be done with this farm run. But yeah, I just managed to get a medium clue scroll from this Slayer task. I think we're going to go do that quickly and hopefully grab ourselves a nice reward. Well, managed to get a medium casket from Dagonoffs and we get... Ooh, what's, I've never... That's the first unique I've ever had. Um, so we've got an amulet of power, mithril legs, tea, adamant full helm, uh, Taibuani um, teleports and a cryo hat. That's pretty awesome. Um, unfortunately, no dog, but we did get this cryo hat, which is pretty awesome. Fashionscape right there. But yeah, I'm going to continue with my Dagonos task, and I'll see you there. Well, just missed the level, but that's 73 attack. Decided to do Dagonos the slower way by killing one at a time. That means I will get more combat experience than um, range, even though I do want to get I'm so close to a range level there, as you can see. But I thought I'd do it this way instead. Oh, and there is another clue scroll. We are going to do this one quickly and then hopefully get another one before the, before the task is over. And the second clue. And the second clue scroll from Dagonoff. So we get. Ooh, Ancient Crozier. That's actually not a bad clue, especially for a medium. Ew, let's have a look at this. 
Oh, okay. I need a higher prayer before I can wield this, but that's pretty decent. How much is it going for? 1k. So what? Oh my god, the chaps are the ones that are worth 440. Holy cow, I didn't realize that. They're really expensive. Damn. But yeah, there is a reward from that. Not the greatest, unfortunately. But it's still nice, a nice little unique. We've, so far, we've got, managed to get two uniques from Clue Scrolls. I really need to organize all this, but I'll do that at a later date. But yeah, I need to finish off my Dagonoffs. How many have we got left? Uh, just 59. We might be able to get another Clue Scroll in that space of time. But yeah, there we go. Just managed to get 68 Slayer. Unfortunately, it's not Kraken level, but it's still pretty nice. Um, I'm going to hopefully try and get this to, up to... Uh, I can't remember what the Kraken is actually, I think it's like 72 or something. So we're going to try and get it up to that and then hopefully be able to take out the Kraken. If we can do that once we hit 73 magic as well, that would be pretty awesome. Then we can get ourselves a Trident and hopefully, fingers crossed, go for the Kraken boss and hopefully get some tentacles and stuff. But yeah, there is a Slayer level and hopefully it's, there's more to come. Right, so we managed to finish that task. I'm going to quit. No more clue, clue scrolls, unfortunately. We're going to grab another assignment from Neve. Ooh, Turf, not too bad. Shouldn't take too long. Uh, I'm kind of debating on whether to skip it or not. Actually, do you not know? I'm going to start saving up my points because I want to start making some Slayer Rings, even though we do need to get 75 crafting. But yeah, I am going to go do the, this Turf craft, uh, quest uh, uh, task and see if we can get anything nice. I'll check out my miscellaneous for the video. Going to see what we get. Check our resources right now. They've taken about 100k already, holy cow. Uh, let's check what we got. Eh, not the greatest. We've got some Ranars, some Dwarf Weeds. Six Ranars, though, isn't too bad. I might be able to get some more prayer potions out of that. And 119, 190 Teak Logs, which is pretty decent, actually. But yeah, I think what I want to do is I actually want to get some more seeds because we are running really low. I'm going to keep this how it is. I might just deposit another... Let's just deposit... Uh, let's actually go... Five to four k. There you go. So now we've got exactly a meal, maybe a little bit under over a meal, but yeah, I'm gonna do that. Leave that in there for now, and hopefully that will be able to make me a ton of money. As you can see, I'm trying to grow our cat so we can do the uh, uh, what's it, Evil Dave's part of Recipe for Disaster, because I want to get that quest out of the way. Um, if not in this video, maybe the next. But yeah, hopefully we get that done soon. So and what's going on, guys? Thank you so much for watching this episode. It has been. I've been really enjoying re recording these videos again. Um, if you did enjoy this video, please be sure to rate the video down below with a like. And comment for any future things that you would like to see. Um, just currently catching some monkfish, so it's a bit of a sport. Well, you've seen everything that's happened, so it doesn't really matter. I've managed to get some nice levels in there, especially like the 80 cooking. Uh, not cooking, sorry. 80 fire, fire making. I managed to get our stats up, got a combat level and a few other little levels but unfortunately we are still so far away from my goal of 87 slayer so right now i'm just catching some monkfish to go and get some more slayer tasks done but yeah um if you what what i want you guys to do is down below in the comments leave suggestions for future episodes because i'm stumped i'm not sure 100 percent sure what I, what I should do to make this this uh, account progress further now obviously we could do our, all of our quests i do really want to get recipes recipe for disaster out of the way i've heard it's a really easy quest so i don't know why i'm logging it off um i think the main reason is because i've got to do evil david's part and i need to get a kit i need to grow my kitten into a full-grown cat because it's taken so long to catch rats on that mini quest um, but yeah, other than that, that quest is pretty easy. It's just the fight at the end I'm probably worried about because I've never actually done it before. Um, other than that, my other goals are to get 70 range and have a go at the fight, uh, fight caves um, to try and get ourselves a fire cape. That would be quite awesome to get. Um, other than that, that's not really... Any other goals that I can think of? Obviously, I would like to get all my stats up to about 70, uh, but that could take a while. Uh, especially with these ones like farm, far, yeah, farming, which is on level 46. I am managing to get like one or two levels a day, um, which is pretty awesome. But obviously, once I get to like level 60 and that, it's going to take a lot longer to get a level. Uh, at the moment, I'm currently working on 70 fishing, so we can get enough fish for that. I think we're going to get about another 100 odd, 150 before we get to 65. Um, but besides that, 
Uh, I've skills that I really want to work on: thieving, fletching. I know fletching's already above seventy, but I want to get. I want to round it off to eighty because these eighty stats look really nice. Same with the attack strength and defense. I want to get that to eighty. Seventy-five magic, and obviously the eighty-seven slayer, just so we can kill the cave kraken. Really want to get my hunter up as well. So yeah, any suggestions on anything that I've just mentioned, please leave them in the comments down below. Thank you so much for watching. Like I said, please be sure to rate the video, subscribe, and I'll see you next time.